Hello everyone, thank you so much for tuning in. Well, we are on our way to the park for some midday fun. Um, we have been doing a lot in our house uh, and a lot of it has been technology and screen time. Nothing's wrong with those things, um, but you know, you, you it's always good to get a break always have a break oh my goodness that that was almost an accident that was almost an accident anyway so i'm headed to the playground just picked up did a pickup order from target i had to get some water bottles um and some snacks to go with our lunches uh i packed peanut butter and jelly sandwiches as well as some mixed nuts, like a trail mixed nuts, you know, um, some sliced apples, and then to go with it, we have some plain tortilla chips, some purified water, and some freeze-dried, freeze-dried um, strawberries. That's pretty much it. Nothing, nothing, you know, spectacular. And you don't really have to do stuff like that. You can just go to the park and bring what you already eat. Um, don't really have that much on my schedule today, but I do plan on getting my overage clothes. So like I have a very minimal wardrobe and a lot of that has to do with the fact that I have lost 66 pounds to date um, over the, a matter of, let me think, I think that's seven, no, over a matter, I was about to say seven months, but I feel like it's been more than seven months. It's probably been closer to a year. No, wait. February. Oh, I can't remember. I've been losing weight. Anyway, with losing weight uh, comes a huge inconvenience um, in your clothing because you... Okay, so I remember now. So I lost close to 40 pounds last year. And that was great. And I, I felt like I was going to be that same size, um, you know, going forward that I would maintain that size, which was like 200. So I went from 284 to 200 and I think it was 31. You do the math um, in between there. So I lost that and I was like, okay, great. Now I am 200, like 18. <laughs> and while this is great, it is kind of difficult because last year I, I purchased an entire wardrobe. Um, it was it was also minimal, but it was one that I really took a lot of time to do. Ordered specific clothing, you know, just was very deliberate and um this year, I literally can only fit this one dress and two other two other pieces from that wardrobe. And you know, it's a it's a good problem. My husband says it's a good problem to have to not be able to fit clothes like that you're smaller than the item. But for someone like me who really practices frugality and really enjoys fashion and picks out you know clothing a lot it it, it, it was very disappointing very disheartening <laughs> to say the least so um i'm going when i get back home i am going to go through my clothing um that i know i cannot fit pack that up take that more than likely to like a thrift store drop that off i have other things i need to drop off like um i redid all of our linens in our house 
and so we have now white fluffy towels and I want to get rid of all of the other towels that we have so I'm going to donate those probably to the animal shelter so I'm going to probably drop those off just so that you know because they use they use those a lot don't get an accident now um hopefully these people let me get over because this street has lanes that automatically only like they just turn into another lane you're like oh okay now it's going to turn um but yeah so that's really what's on my schedule for today I'm almost to the uh, park that we're gonna go to but yeah nothing too big and I, I think it's good to make videos where it's nothing too big because I know so often people create videos or try to video themselves doing all of these spectacular things and honestly I really love my life I love how simple it is um, I love that I find value and beauty in the simplicity of it and so that's really what I want to show in this whole vlogtober of course there are some wonderful outings and things that we will do but you know a homemaker's life is no different no different than anyone else's life it has its routines it has um, its beauty it has its enjoyment it has it's tedious spaces it has all of the same things and it, and it has the same value it adds the same value to the world and to the family unit and so um yeah that's that's really my little small little rant but uh we're almost at the playground i really like this playground too because it has a a, a variation of different spaces you'll see what i'm talking about All right, so we made it to the playground. And um, we're just gonna hang out. I am gonna show you what's in my picnic basket. This is gonna be so funny because it's not aesthetically pleasing to no one. <laughs> but it's reality, okay? All right, look at this, look at this blanket. Look at this blanket. This has the smalls on it. The smalls are the little kids. I don't know if I ever said that. Okay. It's me. Yeah, it's you. We got a couple of runny nose. Well, not runny nose. It's, uh runny nose is from no, crying. Yeah. <laughs> what you gonna say? Yeah, like, oh yeah, it's runny noses. Um, but we have some freeze dried strawberries. We have apples apple slices um this is my peanut butter jelly sandwich I, like i said i only pack peanut butter jelly sandwiches um what else do we have some empty packets of cars because you know that's the best part right there the reasons why we have cars can you see that can you see what it says uh-huh it says detroit born mm -hmm that's me um we have a super tall giant 10 year old so it's super super buff 13 year old okay never mind <laughs> he said he's not that buff and that's what we're gonna stick with there um okay you see leaf and we have leaves falling are they falling they falling down? It's up here. That is a leaf and it is falling down. You should catch it. No, we got regular. I know. I didn't wanna I didn't want to make the sandwiches with regular bread. I used the gluten free bread. Because I knew the little kids wouldn't know the difference. 
Where but the you? big kids do. <laughs> They're like, where's the gluten? I can. Okay. He says it tastes Jay. like soap. Jay. Yeah. What'd you say? I did do my best. Yeah, he didn't mean that. No. Thank you. He did mean that. And it's okay. I didn't make the bread. <laughs> um so yeah. Um that's a picnic. Um can't show you anything else. I don't feel like I feel like there's no difference except for the crust. The crust I can tell the difference, but in the bread, it's really good. The candy. Mm hmm We got the strawberry candy? Yeah. Because uh real fruit snacks is fruit. at you in the camera. Go high right here. You want to go high up in the air? Yeah. Zion, you want to go high? What's in your mouth? Is something in your mouth, Zion? Okay, because it looks like... Let me see. Give, me, give me that. Don't put this in your mouth, okay? 